So it's it's been a great pleasure uh, coming to dialogue here and understanding what NBIOT is and the gathering was amazing. I, I didn't expect this many people to come in and actually participate into this. I think I really appreciate what dialogue did and getting these things into the community and I, I heard they're going to make open source products as well. Uh, so the adaptation of NBIOT will be really high in the coming years. As the government of Sri Lanka, we have many projects and initiatives which needs a lot of technical innovation. Among the youngsters they presented, I saw there were a lot of sensors taken. Those sensors data was transmitted to the databases and a lot of analytics were done and a lot of strategic decisions making process can be strengthened. Those are the main advantages of the government. There will be many more to come where the local IoT enthusiasts will be able to showcase their skills and use the different platforms, use different things and probably ultimately bring something new to our country. basically the enabler. We have a IoT platform. We invited developers to come and develop applications and be IoT and IoT application on top of that to offer services. So going forward our plan is to have a lab dedicated to help NBIoT related developments for the developers from the different communities to come and use our facilities to work on the, this technology and move services forward.